And now, Storm Tracker Weather with meteorologist Cesar Cornejo. Looks a little gloomy to start off the day over in Idaho Falls. We're seeing some smoke still continue in the sky, but as that should start to hopefully clear out with some of this rain that we're expecting, it shouldn't be too bad. But as we step outside the door, we can expect to use a sweater for the day, but by the time we get to the afternoon hours, you can toss it to the side. It won't be necessary. Again, we are under that air quality alert, and it's for all of eastern Idaho, western Wyoming, parts of the central mountains also and we just saw outside that it's pretty just gross out there it looks very scuddy and and just kind of dirty already with the air quality it's something that we are already expecting and why is that well the high pressure system that's still sitting over top of the great basin creating quite a bit of a mess for us also look at that it's bringing in some shower activity from Northern California. So not only just smoke, but now rain. And it's making its way over towards Eastern Oregon and then also into Western Idaho. And that's what we're gonna start to see push into Eastern Idaho throughout the day. Today, we are expecting to still see summer-like conditions, temperatures into the 90s for the Snake River Plain. We're also gonna see temperatures in the higher 80s for Western Wyoming. And as we jump over to the Central Mountains, we're also going to expect to see some temperatures in the mid to high 80s throughout the day. And what are we expecting to see for Future Tracker? We can expect to see that the shower activity begins to pick up for the central mountains towards the late morning early afternoon and as we start to progress into the afternoon hours we are expecting to see some shower activity over along the i-15 corridor so that's something that we might want to keep an eye out as we are heading back from lunch and into the evening time also we'll see a pickup in some activity and while Future Tracker is showing that there is no rain towards the overnight hours, I would not rule out a spot shower throughout tonight as we can expect to see our lows hit into the 60s and upper 50s for the Snake River Plain. We'll see some 40s around in Western Wyoming and into the Central Mountains. And tomorrow we're expecting to see a severe weather day. It's gonna be a marginal day, so it's gonna be a level one out of five and it's going to bring in some isolated showers that can possibly bring some gustier conditions that can damage property. This is going to be something that we'll continue to track for you to make sure that it is not going to impede any of your plants throughout the day. Also, remember when you do hear thunder roar, please head indoors. And what we're expecting to see for our air quality today, it's not looking any better. It looks to stay around the red and unhealthy conditions throughout the next few days. Hopefully that rain and a change in the air pattern from that high pressure system starts to make its way out and push that smoke away from us. And for your Southeast Idaho Chevy dealer seven day forecast, we were expecting to see shower, condition, shower conditions continue for Monday and going into Tuesday and then even into Wednesday with plenty of sunshine after for Thursday and Friday. And then we start to see a more fall-like weekend for the second half on Sunday with a high of 83 degrees. Idaho Falls, we are still expecting to see quite a bit of summer and some of those su summer showers while we expect to then dry up for the second half of the weekend going into the weekend. And for the Teton area, we're seeing plenty of shower activity throughout the week, temperatures remaining into the 80s. And then by the time we get to Saturday and Sunday, take a look at that cooler temperatures so far and we're definitely in need of some of that heat relief for the central mountains we are expecting to see a few sh lingering showers throughout the work week and by the time we get to the weekend we'll start to see plenty of beautiful blue skies and plenty of sunshine 